What's going on, guys? Clutch here on Oakfield Farm. Uh, we're just finishing up another quick silage harvest here out in the rain on Oakfield. <laughs> um, was it last episode I was complaining about the fact that we'd never get rain in this game? And I think since I said that, I have been dealing with the rain this whole time. I think I've been dealing with the rain the whole time. Um, what do we got going on today? Well, we're going to finish this. This is the last of the silage. But this field right behind us here, field 15, yeah, field 15 is what I'm after, guys. That's the biggest field on this on this map. I really want to do something to it. It's been staring at me for the last 30 some odd episodes. I'm just looking at that massive field. Do something, harvest me, harvest me. Oh man, so I gotta do something with that thing today. We're gonna be uh, figuring something out. I don't know yet. Well, I kind of know. <laughs> oh man so right now silage prices are killing it i think we get about 100 grand per trailer full right now or uh, 50 grand sorry 100 grand for both trailers which is pretty decent it's a little over actually i think it's like 105 i've been getting that's just not bad at all so you look at our bank account now we're up to over well, 700 000. we'll be at uh, 770 i bet we 760 by the time we unload these that's not bad that's not bad at all. God, I've got some, some serious plans for that. Um, let's see, we'll drop the first one. Let's see how my backing up skills are doing. You know what, I've been killing this the last little couple times too. Now that I'm recording, I'm sure this is going to fail miserably. And uh, you guys can make fun of me again at the fact that Clutch can't back up a trailer. Oh, no, 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 turn, 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 turn. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Oh, get it right in there. Nice and easy. Just tap it in. Tap it in. Tap it in. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Somebody learned how to drive. Uh, open this. Drop that in there. Boom. 52 8. Not bad at all. Oops. That is not bad, guys. I'm really happy about that. So that's 741,000. Let's go move this around. You know what? We're going to leave this right down here for now. Keep it out of our way because, uh, well, we're going to be leaving these. We're not going to be touching these for a little bit. Let me grab this thing around. That's why I love it with this little tractor. Oh, man, I think it just spins around on a dime. It doesn't worry about a thing. You are good to go. You get these tight little spaces and you can just kind of crank it over. Meow. <laughs> uh, grab that. Let's see if we can back this one in just the same. And stop. And nice and easy. Nice and easy. Not too much. Not too much. Not too much. Uh, there we go. And crank it a bit more. Straight it out. Look at that. Not bad, guys. I'm pretty. I'm pretty impressed with my skills there. If I don't say so myself. Um, I think episode one when I was using these things. This all over the map. Um, it is a skill you can learn. Look at that. Uh, there we go. Pull it in. Perfect. Cool, guys. We were done. Look at that. 780 grand. Perfect. So I've got some big plans for that money. I'm going to wait till this rain lets up. I've been dealing with this rain for the last while now. I'm trying to pick up all these bales. And I'm sick of it. I'm sick of the rain. So we're going to let this time go. We might do this tomorrow morning. i got some big plans for the morning. So stick around. Let's get to work in the morning. Bitter batter. <laughs> Clutch simulations. All right, guys, welcome back. Well, we are well. We've got both our harvesters, the Lexi and seven eighties, and we are over well field fifteen uh, on Lo on Lone Oak on uh, <laughs> Oak Field. This is in fact the biggest field. There is none bigger than this one on this map. This field is ginormous. This is actually a pretty big field wherever you go, and it's hilly. This is going to be a fight. Now, I've only got two harvesters here. We're going to fix that in a second. As well, we haven't bought the land yet because I only have 700000 This sells for $1.5 Well, the bank's going to be helping us out with that. Now, I thought for a bit, we have some large grass fields over beside our farm there. Why not just buy one of those clutch? You know, you can just buy more silage or make more silage, sell that off. You know what? I'm kind of sick of looking at this field. We're going to take one harvest from this farmer and flip this field. Uh, I want to see how much money we can make off this. Yeah, I know. We're flipping a field. 
<laughs> let me hear about it in the comments. That's okay. I'm good with it. But I want to see how much money we can make off this massive field. We're going to sell this field back right after we're done uh, harvesting it. But I just want to see how much barley we can pull off this thing. So this is all barley. So this is all going to be, uh, it's not even going to be an easy crop to harvest. Oh, man. Yeah, that's going to be fun. So I got to go to the bank, get some money out, buy this field, get some equipment down here. And, well, then we get to work. <laughs> All right, so we've taken out a loan for $2.5 million. Two and a half million. This land that we purchased, it was worth 1.7 something. Holy, it's a lot of cash. Hopefully, we'll get this all back, though, once we flip this land. Now, I've also set... Uh, let's see if it'll work here. I did set the stores person. Uh, is it going to work again? I find this is so finicky to get to work. Sometimes I can get it right off the bat. Other times, I just can't get this delivery mod. There it goes. So we have set that to be right in there. Perfect. Let's go into our store. We're going to lease a couple of harvesters. Uh, where are our cloths? There we go. The 780. Perfect. Uh, we need, we want to go with all tracks again. And we'll go with that. will be number three. And lease. Perfect. We'll get number four. And lease. And number five. And lease. Perfect. All right, I'm going to get the headers as well, but that's about it for the equipment. <laughs> oh, yes. And there we have it. So the deliveries mod does work with leased equipment as it would with the purchase of equipment. Now, the one thing it doesn't do, I was hoping that that mod would work with resetting vehicles. You could just tell it to reset to a certain location. It doesn't work in that case, but it works for everything else for that. So that's cool. Um, anyways, I've got a lot of work to do to get these all prepped. We got to get uh, these headers on our harvesters. And then we've got to, well, get these headers on these harvesters, and then we have to set up court. Oh, man, there's so many things to do right now. Um, you know what? I better stop yapping and get to work doing it, I guess. Uh, we'll start with this one over here, number two. I'm just going to pull it overhead so our, our trailer is out of the way. And that should be good enough. Perfect. Spin her around. We'll grab the header and get it in line. So we'll do this with every single one of these harvesters. Oh, come on. Uh, and where should we start? I think if we start in this bottom corner, that'll be the best place to get going. I'm just going to get him down out of the way, so uh, he's ready to rock, though. Kind of on the inside. I'm going to see if I can keep their numbers in order, too. Might make life a little bit easier in the long run for me. Yeah, we'll leave him running. That's fine. That is totally fine. We'll grab this one while we're right here. Now, I accidentally did purchase one of the headers. I didn't mean to. I meant to lease it, and I forgot. Um, yeah, that happens. <laughs> <laughs> uh, grab that one. Excellent. So we'll have to remember to sell that off. Whatever one's worth the most at the end because our our headers should be relatively beat up by the time it's all said and done since we haven't really fixed them for a while. I noticed the paint was wearing a little bit thin on them. But uh, we'll see what we can do here. Come on, get in there. All right, one more here. And uh, then we just got the last number five and ours to set up, but we'll have a whole line of harvesters. I'm going to need to figure out how I'm going to get the grain out of these harvesters and out to our sell point. Uh, I need to figure that out. This is going to be a little bit of logisticals <laughs> that I'm going to need to figure out before we get too far ahead of ourselves, guys. So let me work on that. I'm going to finish up getting these guys ready to go. And once I kind of have things kind of sorted with that, we'll, uh, we'll be back with whatever we got going on there. I don't know what I'm going to do yet for that. Eugh. All right, so I think everything is set up, and we are definitely on the clock now, guys. So let me just give you a quick rundown, but we need to get to work because, well, we're burning money now. Uh, we got our cloths, of course, the Zerian 5000 and the awesome black chrome wheels. This thing is so blinged out. I love this tractor, by the way. Um, but anyways, that is ours. But behind that, we have the Bergman. This is a 49 no, 4300 or 4300 liter uh, tipper, or auger wagon tip. Come on, clutch. The auger wagon. Uh, that's leased. That has cost us only 5000 bucks initially, but obviously the more we use it over the hours, it's going to cost us more. Another MAN, another five grand. Uh, the Bono trailer, that's I think a 49000 maybe 59000 on this one, I think. It's, it's bigger than the uh, the other one that we have, the Kempe, the Krempe that we have there. So the Bono is uh, a little bit bigger, but I think combined we're looking a little under $10,000 for the lease on this. Well, as long as we only use it for an hour, which I doubt that's going to happen. And then each of the harvesters are 20 grand, headers an extra three. So all in, you know what, we're under 150,000 right now for all our leasing of equipment, but we need to get to work. So uh, I'm gonna get this prepped. I think I have courses set up on this stuff already. 
You can see there, they're already kind of prepped. I just want to get him into the crop, into the field here. Actually, you know what? He's going the other way. Let's see if I can uh, fire this up. Now, I do not want to make straw. I don't want to. There's no way. I am not bailing all this. Uh, where are we going? Drive course. Let's see if he does this correctly or if he's going to mess this all up for me. Come on. Turn into the field. I think he's going to turn in at some point here. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, dude, what are you doing? Come on. There we go. Perfect. And now, for the moment of truth, did I set it up correctly? That is going to be the question. <laughs> Look at these guys. Everyone's jockeying for position back here. Let's see. I don't want to be too much in their face. Once I get it all set up, then we can kind of set it... Oh, dude, what are you guys doing? You're killing me back there. I'm just going to get this guy up to it. I get him set over at 12. I think 12 is the number. I sure hope it is. <laughs> Look at this. Once they get kind of situated, I hope it'll be okay. Alright, that's, that's set... I don't know if this is going to work. I sure hope it does. Let's find out. All right. And ready to go. Drive course, dude. See ya. I just hope it was 12. I hope 12 was the correct one. I have no idea if it was. You know what? 12 looks pretty good on him. Yeah, that's perfect. All right. So we got him set up. How are you doing back here? You're going? Ah, uh, these two got tangled. I gotta go fix this. Yeah, 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 you're blocked by an object. Of course you are. Of course you are. I'll get that going. Go, 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 go. And we just need to get him set up and going. Once everything's rocking and rolling, we should... Oh, what is he doing back there? <laughs> He's doing donuts behind me. Uh, once we get it all set up, get this last little bit... And perfect. Let's let him go. Is he missing everything there? Good, he is too. Oh yes, boys. Oh yeah, five harvest, harvest going on. Five harvester, harvest five. Oh no, and I got straw swap on. That's all right. <laughs> I did not mean to leave that on. I definitely did not mean to leave that on. Ah, oh, that's gonna be a lot. But we're not bailing that. There's no way. Uh, but whatever, that's fine. <laughs> Let me grab this tractor. We're going to head out in the field and watch the pandemonium. I want to see how that first corner is going to turn out. Um, now, this is going to be our next problem. I forgot to open the uh, the pipes on all these tractors. And, uh, yeah. Um, I didn't think that through. Now, did I? They're all going to be in spots where I can't really access them because... It hasn't been harvested on the inside yet. Ah, oh, clutch, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> I should have went and did it counterclockwise. Then I could have done this. Um, yeah, that's going to be a bit of an issue. Which, well, we'll deal with it when it comes, I guess. Uh, that sucks. That's really not smart of me. Yeah, that's really not smart of me at all. I was trying to be a little bit proactive on this. Now, what I could do is if I got each harvester close enough to each other, could they get that close? No, they can't. I was thinking if we could get them close enough, they could dump into each other, but there's no way that's going to work out for us. So I'm going to have to do, uh, well, some creative... <laughs> some creative offloading. Look at all these harvesters just go into town. Oh, man. So he's on the inside line. I thought I'd try something totally different on the inside line just to see if I could figure out a better way of doing this. Um... It's okay, but obviously the problem I'm running into now is that, well, with him on the inside line, I forgot that the pipe is on the wrong side, so I'm going to have to fight my way through to find a way to unload all these guys. That's kind of too bad. All right, so it's all coming together. Look at this. So good. Uh, yeah, so we've already dumped off a whole bunch of barley. Uh, we're still on our first lap, mind you. Look at all the snorkels are up. We're just fighting a little bit with these... Uh, <laughs> the harvesters again follow me to work. The corners are not fun. I'm not going to lie. The corners have been a fight so far. But what do you do? 
Um, why are you stopping? Okay, no reason. I think you're okay. I think we're okay. Let's see if we can get it nice and tight. Uh, I think good enough. Let's grab some more off this guy up here. So, the key with this guy is like before, is we do not want to let any of these harvesters fill right up. The front one is okay because he's running on course plate. These back ones are all running on follow me. So, if they will just keep on going if they're full, and I don't want that to happen. So, I'm just kind of constantly monitoring these back harvesters to make sure that they have been emptied consistently. It seems like we're doing okay with that. Uh, we're going to grab this guy right here now. Number three. Looks like he's getting a little bit full. And then we'll grab... Oh, whoa, whoa, come back here. I think uh, this actual load will probably fill us up completely. We'll have to go take both of our trucks up to our farm and dump. Because I don't think we're going to have any room left after this. I can't believe how much we've already gotten out of this. Uh, one lap and we have filled up both of those trucks already. Yeah, that's that's quite a bit. Quite a bit. Uh, Alright, he's full. Perfect. Or empty, I should say. What are... What is he doing? <laughs> he's doing donuts. Uh, yeah, we need to stop. 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 Boom. Okay. We'll leave you here for now. Uh, I'm going to go empty this guy out. What was... What is he doing over there? Apparently I didn't set that course up correctly because he is doing something he's not supposed to be doing. Dude, seriously. <laughs> Alright, well let's go dump this out and we're going to take these trucks up. Um, I may see if I can organize that guy so he can quit ballerina dancing in the middle of the field here. Why are you doing that? So, one thing I have had a problem with. Uh, let's see if he's just going to stop. Oh, easy. Why are you chasing me? <laughs> is this t uh, trailer is it kind of odd? It does not want to. Uh, there's no the trigger point for the auger wagon is well, it's hit and miss. Uh, well, that seemed to work out better than normal. So we'll let that go to its thing. Um, all right, I think he's actually going where I want him to go. So I'm gonna go grab this guy and get him to set back up again. I don't, I don't know. I really, I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what that was all about. Let's see if I can grab a little bit here. And get these guys to follow in line. But that was bizarre. The whole backup sequence he was doing there. And then he goes and finds the right path, which kind of amazes me. I, I don't know, guys. <laughs> I don't have an answer on what that was all about. Um, and see, this guy's going to do the exact same thing. Uh, this, this is painful. Yeah, thanks. Anyways, we'll get... Uh, yeah, I can't get him to connect to that yet. Uh, we'll see if he ever catches up to this guy. Let's see if I can get close enough. Go, 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 go. And drop it back down. Missed a little bit. That's okay. I don't think I can get close enough now. I'm going to be stuck. Yeah, it's too far behind. He's not picking it up. And what's this guy doing back there? Yeah, see, he's all stuck. This is the problem with all of these things running. You hit these corners, and all of a sudden, it just turns into this. And I don't know where he is going up there. You're missing half the field. Dude, this was supposed to be easy. This was supposed to be so easy. Uh, and you failed me. I don't know where you're going, but now I'm stuck following you. So I'm not quite sure what that was all about, but uh, I think we've got things squared away again. Oh, man. <laughs> the trials and tribulations of using course play and follow me. Uh, at least follow me, it seems like... For the well, you know what? That's what I'm having problems with. I can't even say that. I can't even say it, dude. I just cannot say it. All right. We're going to finish this off. i got to run over and unload those trucks. Let's go get those guys up to the top. All right, and we're back at her once again. Oh, man. I am struggling with this. Guys, this was supposed to be simple. That was supposed to be fun. It's turned into just a huge pain. Nothing seems to be going right. <laughs> oh, man. So we've got... Oh, man. We've already emptied both trucks once now. We're only on our second lap. I think we've got probably four to do in total. It's the corners. The corners are just killing me. All right. He's done. Uh, let's see if I can grab some more on the way back. I'll see if I can fill up. 
I think number two should be emptied already. I'm not really worried about him. But I will grab if I can. Uh, you know what? Looks like two's actually got more than I thought. I better grab some more from two. Because that's one of the ones I do not want to fill up for sure. Grab everything I possibly can. Oh, uh, see, that might work a little bit better. He's taking a bit of an easier corner. We're going to waste a little bit of barley, but that's not bad. At least it's a corner instead of what he's been doing in the past. is just these hard 90s and everybody just kind of bungs up into each other. Okay, good enough. Uh, what else we got back here? Let's go right to the very, very back and grab number five. I mean, even these little soft corners, man, they're still... I thought I have... They're at like 60 uh, feet behind. The base is set at like 25, and they're still running into issues here. Okay, we need to stop you. We need to stop and quit being dumb. Back up. Give him some space. It's not rocket science, guys. Come on. Yeah, the corners just don't work the way they they should. I, in my opinion, I don't know. It seems like they uh, they just kind of get confused and they try to get right up on top of each other. Regardless, it's like the back end of that the harvester they feel is far too far away. Like, like ah, this guy here, like, where are you gonna go? Anyways, it's just a bit of a fight. Like right now, this number four should not be that close to number three. I don't know what he's measuring to get that close. He's set at 65 feet, and 60, yeah, whatever. And he still gets right up on him on the corners. And I don't quite understand why he's doing that. And why are you stopped now? You think I'm holding you up? There we go. All right. Yeah, see, there's no reason for any of that. Ah, I don't know what to do with that. <laughs> um... So we still got quite a bit left of fuel to harvest here, guys. I'm going to go take this load. We got, what, 73? I'm going to see if I can get the rest of his his uh, tipper or his whatever he's got left in his tank into here. And maybe I'll go drop that off. Yeah, close enough. Is it empty? I can't quite see. Yeah, he's not grabbing enough. Should be, a, should be good, though. Let's empty that. All right, good enough. Let's go get rid of this stuff. Keep on going. So we're about two-thirds of the way done working uh, the field. Having some issues still with course play. But uh, let's see here. Where is he? We've dumped this once before. One of the issues I kind of forgot about was the hill that we need to get up into our farm. So we got to come in. Oh, hopefully he makes that corner. Easy, easy. Holy. Oh, stop, 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 stop. Okay, perfect. Um, <laughs> oh, nice corner, brother. Nice corner. So, one of the problems, get in there, that we're going to have, that we have been having, is climbing this hill. We need to uh, have some serious speed to get up to the top. <laughs> and, uh, there's just no brakes when you got a full load. Now, this back one is a little bit heavier. Uh, no, I, I, thank you. You can take that. And he's going to smash into it. Yep, there we go. All right, now hopefully we can just hit the gas here. And go, 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 get up the hill, get up the hill. No slowing down now. Go as fast as you can. Come on, baby, get up there. Oh, 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 oh. Ugh, that was close. All right, no problem, no problem, no problem. We're good, we're good, we're good. What is he doing back there? Oh, no, he jackknifed. <laughs> I'll have to run back down and fix that. Now, I don't know how I'm going to get him up here. He lost all his speed. Oh, that's going to be a fight to get that thing up here. Not fun. Uh, the hill, it's just so hilly. It's just... Oh, man, stop. All right, let me run back down below and we'll see if we can uh, fix that problem. All right, guys, so we're just wrapping things up here. Oh, this turned into a disjointed mess of a field to harvest. Holy cow, is that brutal. I have not had a harvest that was that unorganized before. Everything just kind of fell apart as far as pathing goes, as far as, oh man, this field is not fun. Uh, I've been looking at this thing forever, thinking about how much fun it's going to be to harvest this big, massive field. 
it just did not want to work for me at all. Um, <laughs> all right, we got all our harvesters. We're going to have to return. Uh, but we do have, you know what? On the bright side, we got a ton of barley. A ton of it. So I think I made three trips. This will be the fourth, I believe. Anyways, we're not quite full on uh, a couple of them, but we're still looking pretty good. <laughs> and, oh, I never want to do this field again. Yeah, we'll sell it this field right away. But we did make some good money. I'm sure we'll find out tomorrow how much money we made on this field. I hope it's a couple, several hundred million thousand trillions. I don't know how much it's going to be. It's going to be decent, I think. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to get it there yet either. Uh, better not be hilltop stores. We'll never get up there. Anyways, guys, um, I hope you did enjoy this mess of an episode. If you did, make sure you drop a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. Uh, this is Clutch. Over and out.